hello everybody welcome to my channel today in this tutorial i will show how to do a solar analysis of your building project using revit and insight plugin so before we start you need to see the sun settings first so in the below here just click it and come to sun settings so in this stylus box uh, there are lots of options you need to choose from so you can do a solar study of uh, some exact time or like a single day if you want to do analysis of a single day just click or you have options to do of a multi day as well so in this tutorial I will show uh, examples of how we do a solar analysis for a multi day so you just click at the multi day options here and then uh, first you need to choose your location the, the project location where you are doing this analysis so what the plugin does is it takes the weather data of the location you choose from so you just click here and then uh, you can choose your weather station or maybe you can just search where the project of your building is located and choose the nearest uh, weather stations then click ok now the next step is to choose the date so you can choose your date from what time you wanna uh, do a solar analysis like there are multi-day solar analysis spring solar analysis maybe a summer winter so you can also do an analysis for a one whole year so in this tutorial i also for a summer solar study so the summer ranges from 6 21 21 to 21 to maybe 9 so for the three months then just uh, you can time sunrise to sunset or you can remove whatever time you want so it's up to you and then just uh, click apply then okay so our sun settings has been done so for uh, analysis just change your view to hidden frame so it's a bit easy to select the surfaces so now come to this analyze section and then uh, you will be seeing these two tabs here lighting and solar so if you see these two tabs here this means you have already installed insight plugin and if you do not see this means your insight plugin is missing and you need to install it so i have a, diff uh, a video regarding how to install a insight plugin in revit 2022 or any other older versions as well so in this tutorial now what we need to do is just click this solar tab and you will see this uh, dialog box appearing and in this uh, choose this study type as custom as it is and in surfaces choose user selection so there are lots of setting here in study type you can see but you can just double check here what's the project location analysis period everything i will keep it as it is unit you can change what unit you want so i don't do anything here now you can just click this and you can choose other things like what types of insulation do you have already and style of analysis like there are lots of type i have like default one and on the right side you see the uh, some settings here as well the color the color of the results that will be uh, shown after your analysis so what are the intensity of solar light coming in your building so you can change the color what you like also in the legends that i will show you this later how can we change this right now then just uh, so we need to uh, click the surfaces here so for that just click the arrow button right to the user selection just click this you will get this just ignore this one now what you need to do is to select the surfaces where you wanna see what intensity of sunlight is falling or maybe something like that so you can just rotate your building and I will do this this one because this is the top floor so there will be direct sunlight I will choose this uh, walls as well exterior walls I will choose this sorry that's not 
let's just take the blue. Okay. So when you if it's not selected, there is a plus sign. So that means you can select it. So this side is done. I'll move to back side. Select the surfaces for solar study. Something like that. Yeah, come to another side. So this side is also done. We'll come to front side again. Here. So almost I choose all the sides. You can also choose these areas if you wanna study how it was solar sorry sunlight falls in these areas then what is this okay okay so uh, i'll stay remaining here so after you choose this there is an finish hidden here so it's difficult to find at the first place so just click finish this means you have selected your surfaces uh, for solar study so it will show here how much uh, area has been selected so it's in my case it's uh, showing like 452 square meter area is selected okay so now you just need to click update just click this so now you have got your result how much intensity of light would be falling in which areas look so i'll just keep this here uh, if you need to change your color again for this uh, let's just click then you can edit the style color I will put here the red one. Here I will put the blue ones. Okay. So in the legend, you can change the size of your text as well. So if I put this, you see the text size has uh, is decreased. So I pretty much like this uh, settings for my colors. So now. More. okay i'll just close this so this means like uh, the range of kilowatt hour per meter square has been seen so your low color has the highest intensity so we know it should be here itself so these are the places where you can put your solar panels as well also the mid section you have 20 surfaces to put this side also on the another side look there are pretty good intensity to install solar panels so this is your solar study you can uh, do same same process for winter as well or maybe for whole year uh, what time you want to analyze it now so in your project you need to export this photo as well as a picture so to do that just what we need to do first is go to your this tab at the below here search for crop region so click crop view and then just right to next click show crop region so you will get this box and just click it and adjust this way so that it will just show the crop region it's lost so you can just Anyways, wait. Okay, so we have shown our crop region now. Just go to file here and export, and just scroll down. You will see this image and animations, and here image. So here you can change uh, the location where you want to save, and the setting this current window increase the size of the pixel to get a good quality so suppose i put 2500 
you can put higher as well depending upon your strength of your system and for format i will put jpg lossless also for this lossless and i will just keep okay so i think it's uh, already downloaded i will check here so look you i have my figure here so you can just see uh, how much intensity of these are falling in your building project also you can do for winter analysis maybe some spring or full day or full night whatever you like so this is how a solar study is done in revit i think you like it and thank you for today so this much for the solar analysis in my next video i will come with analysis for lighting so what intensity of lights are been uh, coming to each rooms and something like that so thank you bye bye have a nice day